Hey guys, Mike Drober here with 10 Legion Pictures, and today... I don't told you I ain't interested in any of that Sith crap. I find your lack of faith disturbing. Your power's a weak old man. I told you not to come around here before! No, don't come around here no more! Man. We ready now? Hey guys, Mike Jorberg from 10th Legion Pictures, and today we're going to be working on another gun prop. I'm going to show you how to take this, to this, to this. Nice. Alright, well first things first, gotta get rid of these decals. Got a little overzealous with the belt sander. Gonna try to smooth things out with the orbital. First, I'm gonna use grip, then 320 grip. So I did manage to gouge the heck out of the gun with the belt sander. I couldn't fix it with the orbital, so now I'm going to try to fill it in with some spackle. I told you it's not gonna work. Well, that didn't work. Idiot. My neighbor's a car junkie, so luckily he had some of this, and I know this will work. So let's get to it. While the bondo was drying, I dug through my safe and found this gun sight I wasn't using. I think it's pretty cool. It'll add a good effect to the gun and make it look more realistic. A few moments later. One hour later So the filler job didn't come out as bad as I thought uh, We'll let it dry, see what happens Oh, idiot Uh, came out alright, but I think I'm going to make it work. So first thing I'm going to do is glue on the site, just like that.
A few moments later. Good lord's hot. Well, another prop done. I think this one uh, is the best one I've done so far. Uh, pretty cool. The scope definitely adds to the character of the gun. Uh, made a lot of mistakes in this build. Hopefully you learn from them. I know I learned from them. Uh, you can't use spackle for uh, plastic on guns. Um, Bondo definitely worked better, but it's a lot harder to repair and sand, etc. Um, if you found this video enjoyable, please hit the like button, subscribe. Thanks for watching. I'll see you again soon.